Hey, how's it going everybody? It's Tanner here and welcome to a new Ninjago video here on the channel. In today's video, we are going to be talking about the actual storyline of season 15 and what we could potentially see within this. Now, we recently got a brand new poster for season 15. You'll see that on your screen right now. And this poster is fantastic. I love how it looks. It showcases very two different worlds. On the top, we have the ninja in Ninjago City. And then below the water, we see this weird, uh, kind of like octopus looking guy with a trident and of course his army or her army of these underwater villains so we can definitely see two different worlds here now what's intriguing about this is that this poster very well might suggest two different storylines going on in one season and i'm not talking about just the city landscape and the underwater aspect we know that the ninja are going to be leaving ninjago and going to the depths below ninjago going into the deepest parts of the ocean so that's going to be fun they're very much entering one world and going into another world here but what i mean by two different stories, I feel like the ninja themselves kind of suggest this. If we look back at the ninja, you can see a very obvious difference between two of the ninja in particular and the rest of the team. Nia, Jay, Zane, and Lloyd appear to be in their new season 15 scuba-inspired outfits. However, Kai and Cole appear to be in their regular ninja outfits that we got starting with season 11. Now, what exactly is the significance of this? In reality, I really don't think it means much of anything at all, unless it's actually suggesting that those two ninja will have a very different role compared to the other four. I feel like maybe this season could totally explore Kai and Cole teaming up and going off on their own throughout Ninjago City to try to locate something specific or track down a very specific answer or maybe somebody that can help while the remaining four ninja decide to enter the water on their own to actually confront the threat head on. Now why would Kai and Cole be the ones specifically not venturing underwater? Well for Kai it's a pretty easy explanation. I feel like a lot of people are still kind of holding on to Kai's fear of water that we first saw in season five. Now, prior to season five, Kai didn't really have this fear of water, so I'm not sure if this thing is still around or if it was just randomly introduced and removed in season five. But regardless, if Kai is still scared of water, yeah, he's probably not gonna wanna go underwater. For Cole, it would make sense if he was still a ghost, but I can't really figure out a reason as to why Cole would not wanna enter the water. Like I said, there very well could not even be a personal reason as to why these two were chosen specifically to not go underwater. Maybe they just have a different task to do. We know looking at some of the season 15 15 sets, however, that Cole and presumably Kai will both have a scuba outfit, at least at some point in season 15. Maybe that's just an exclusive set thing, but that really doesn't make much sense. So I have no doubt that Kai and Cole, even if they will be staying on the surface for a while, they eventually will join the other four underwater. Now again, as to what this might entail in terms of a story, I have no idea. But we very well could see two stories intersect at one point, like we've seen for several other seasons before. I think season 9 is the most famous example of this. We had two very different stories going on in that season as well in two very different worlds. Now, the underwater aspect of Ninjago and the city aspect of Ninjago are technically the same world, but you get what I mean. They're very different in terms of location and environment, so obviously we might be looking at two very different stories here that could intersect at some point later down the line. Either that, or they just want to showcase that the season 11 suits are still very much relevant for the show, which very well could be the case here, and that's why Kai and Cole are not in their scuba suits in this poster. Either way, I figured it was worth talking about because I've seen a couple of people speculating about it in my comment section and throughout the community. So that's going to pretty much do it for my thoughts on that, guys. Let me know down below in the comments what you think. What do you think is going to be going on in season 15? And do you think there might be multiple storylines going on at once? Leave all your thoughts down below and hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, do all that fun stuff, and check out the links down below in the description for other forms of social media. As always, big shout out to my Patreon supporters, including once again, the Marvelous Jan. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Once again, my name is Hannah Fishies. I'm with that video. Farewell.